Hey, what's going on? It's Juan with 500 Painters, and today I want to show you guys something real quick. So we're painting these ceilings, and right there, and all along here, these bubbles form. Um, so why did these bubbles form? This is a new home. Well, it's not a new home. The homeowner just purchased this home. Whoever sold, whoever was the previous homeowner, probably had some painting done before they put the uh, house up for market because the walls and ceilings are, are, are really clean. Um, so it looked like they have just been recently painted. Uh, you can tell the walls have like a, it's not a um, flat, it's a uh, low sheen finish, which is in most cases the cheaper option of paint and it looks good plus it hides a lot of imperfections. So when you're selling your home, you want to use a uh, low sheen paint because you can hide a lot of stuff so to get back to this, these bubbles right here. So what probably happened is uh, they had some type of repair up here, which means that they did uh, maybe some taping. Uh, definitely put some mud up here, and the uh, and it must have been more uh, pretty recent. So now what's happening as you as we're painting the ceiling, the wet paint is making this kind of bubble up exactly where they had the patches. And if you look here. You can see some patchwork that just that was just done. That's it. Um, but that's not a big deal. So what you do in this case, instead of going and picking at it and p trying to pop it, uh, you're just gonna make it worse. So we're just gonna let that sit. We're gonna turn up the heat a little bit in here to maybe like 74, 73, and we're gonna let that sit and come back in uh, in about an hour or two and. They should be gone then. All right, so I'm back. We let this dry for about an hour. And as you can see, all the bubbles are gone. The ceiling is still drying. But yeah, basically all the bubbles disappeared. All right, to sum it all up, there's uh, multiple factors that could be uh, causing those bubbles in your ceiling or your walls. So whenever you're painting and you do get those bubbles, uh, first instinct might be to just peel them and scratch them off, uh, just let them dry. Don't worry about it, they'll go away um, eventually. Because if you do uh, peel them off and pop them, what's gonna happen is you're gonna have to skim coat it again, let that dry, prime paint, and it's just more work. Be patient, let it sit, they'll go away, and uh, you can just go about your business. 